Good morning, my name is Landy, this is Catch Rose and uh, um, this video shows you how to connect the forms because uh, we want to get all over the fretboard but uh, you know the whole fretboard is like you uh, you get to a big party and you have like a typical German so oh there's food okay so I get you everything no do it in small steps so you have to see shape and it's called cage this means the next form is the A shape this is C form right here root third fifth and now we have the a form with the root fifth root so and you practice c and if you practice that maybe you can do it in another position with d and it's pretty hard to get the few and don't uh, get in a chaos or lose uh, something like or uh, uh, have a, something like a blackout okay we have c and a form and then we have a and g form which i told in the video before this the long a form is nothing else as the a form a chord with a form and a chord with g form and so we have like a really so on uh, let it be it's a uh, I got a feeling okay then uh, we have the G form and uh, um, the G form and the E form they have the same root so you can say the one chord looks up because the index is on your root or the chord looks down so it, it doesn't matter how you think uh, it's just a thing you have to find it and uh, play the right stuff okay so we have C and A we have A and G and we have G and E D. So if you look at cage, you always have form and then E D, which is in the name cage. And then you get F. And if I play rock, if I play reggae, so I use this. It's both the F chord, but I know where to find another position for the same chord. And if you have two guitar players, it's always good if the one play the basic form and the other play anywhere upside down just watch uh, just uh, um, listen to ACDC this is one of the greatest uh, guitar arrangements okay and we have E and D and then we have D and C form. D D chord and D form D and C form and this is uh, like D flat D and if you see the typical C major chord and you move it up so you see there's many things there have the chords together you can't see a chord or a shape alone but you know um, we split because we have to get an idea of the fretboard but the fretboard is not split it so D form and C form okay so I repeat C and A form are neighbors A and G form are neighbors and the G and the E form are neighbors um, uh, these neighbors love each other it's not like typical neighbors and then I have a E and D form and then I have the D and the C form and you can move it all over your fretboard okay next uh, uh, video will say um, uh, I think uh, we do something like hey Joe to learn the chords see you then